Quarter, Module 4 Stages in the Life Cycle of Organisms By the end of this module, you are expected to identify the different stages in the life cycle of human, butterfly, frog, and cockroach. List and tabulate the different stages of seed germination and compare and contrast the different stages in the life cycle of humans, animals, and plants. For our quick review, put check on activities that show caring for the plants and crust if not. Number 1. Placing the potted plant brighter is sunlight. 2. Watering the plants every day. 3. Covering the plants with plastic. 4. Using the proper soil for its type of plant. And number 5. Picking flowers and leaves. Now compare your answer. Do you get all the numbers right? Okay, great. Now let us proceed to activity number 1. Certified Plantito and Plantita. In this activity, you will be needing 10 mango seeds, cotton, one plastic cup, and water. In a plastic cup, put a piece of cotton enough to cover the bottom of the cup. Then, put 10 mango seeds in the cup. Add enough water to soak the seeds. Observe the changes that will happen to the seed after 5 days. Record the daily growth of the seeds and tabulate the observations in your notebook. Seed germination is the process in which the seed develops into a new plant under favorable conditions like proper amount of water, sunlight, temperature, and air. This is the first step in seed germination. First, the seed must uptake enough water, air, soil, sunlight, and have good temperature. Next, when the seed absorbs the water, embryo begins to grow and roots started to appear. Then, stems begins to straighten out. Finally, the shoots grows leaves and now able to make its own food. This is the questions that you need to answer after observing the development of seed germination. 1. What changes did you notice in the seed size and seed coat during the first two days? 2. What structure first came out from the seed? Describe it. And number 3. What happened to the bean sprout after five days? Now let us proceed to activity number 2, Ultimate Transformation. Metamorphosis refers to the process of how organisms like insects develop, grow, and change from an egg to a very active larva, then an inactive pupa. Another term for pupa is chrysalis or cocoon. And finally, an adult butterfly. Butterfly undergoes a complete type of metamorphosis. Incomplete metamorphosis has three developmental stages such as egg, a nymph that looks like a miniature of adult or smaller version, and an adult. Cockroaches and grasshoppers go through this process. A frog is an egg-laying animal which also undergoes stages of development. 
first the female frog lay eggs on water plant and then the eggs hatch into tiny tadpoles. They use their gills for breathing and tail for swimming. As the tadpole grows, hind legs start to appear. Later, front legs appear. As the tail of tadpole becomes shorter, its gills also disappear. The lungs develop. The young frog can now live into the land. The young frog becomes an adult frog. Okay, now let's move on to different stages of human development. Infancy. This stage is the period of rapid growth of a child, starting from birth to two years old. Childhood. This stage is composed of early childhood from ages 3 to 8 years old called the preschool age and the middle childhood from age, from age 9 to 11 years old called the school age. Adolescence This stage is the period of transition between childhood and adulthood. In this stage, the physical, intellectual, personality and social development of children changes. Then finally, adulthood. This stage is the period when the physical and intellectual maturity of human have been attained. Now to check your understanding, identify the words that best fits into the given descriptions. Write the correct answer on your answer sheet. Okay, for number one, I am an amphibian because I live in water and on land. My eggs develop into tadpole. I can catch prey using my sticky tongue. Number two, I love bubbling and suckling my tongue. I begin to crawl and stand with assistance. I am completely dependent on my caretakers. I am the first stage of development of some plants. I need soil, water, sunlight, air, and dry temperature to grow. My eggs are encased in a capsule. I emerge from a nymph. I am attracted to damp and warm areas. My eggs hatch in a caterpillar. You can see me roaming around in the garden and forest. I am the most colorful insect. Okay, now compare your answer. Do you get all the numbers right? Good! I know you are now ready to answer the post test. Enjoy learning!